So I want to, I want to operate, you know, as my highest self. And right now, I'm high, but I am my highest, you know? <laughs> the company is going to be there regardless. Whether I was what I want to eat or whether I was bigger than I am. So <laughs> you can forget that. We're not lacking self-confidence on this channel. That's not what we do. Yeah, I know it's a few house rules. <laughs> not really. I just make them as I go. But yeah, girl, what we do have is self-confidence. And we're always going to be that girl or that boy no matter what. <laughs> So what's poppin' and hey homeboys, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. My name is Mercedes. And today, I don't feel like doing absolutely anything, but that's not my life. I'm a boss, a period. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, I'm tired. I'm hot. I'm having hot flashes. Oh, girl, I'm on my cycle. My cycle is cycling. I don't like it. Today is not my day, but I'm gonna make today my day. All right, this this will be doing. Even when it's not our day, it's going to be our day. But yeah, y'all know I am really hot. I'm hot. My cycle is cycling. It also don't help that I'm standing right here by all these windows. So yeah, if my top lip is sweating, you already know what's up, sis. Anyways, um, I'm about to head out and go to my office. I have some other errands. I need to run the Sam's and stuff like that. But first things first, I have two wigs that they absolutely have to go. Um, so I have two wigs that I need to make and ship today. I'm doing a light day today since I don't feel good. Y'all know normally I like to do between three to five wigs a day. Baby, I got a good two in me and then I'm done. Like I'm tired. So yeah, that's that. And then the wigs that I have to make, they're identical to one another. Like I make the same wigs pretty much over and over. Like but hey, I love it. I love it if y'all love it. But um, yeah, it's a no makeup type of day. I did throw on some lashes and I love these glasses because my lashes can fit underneath. I really liked it about these glasses. What else was I about to tell y'all? Oh yeah, y'all see that? My water bottle, I got a new water bottle. I'ma link it, girl, you need that. Um, I showed y'all my gallon water bottle. This is the old water bottle that I told y'all to get. This one is still very much that girl. However, like if you're like me on the go, this thing is huge. This is for my sis who can do the one gallon cause you're sitting maybe at your desk or you're working from home or something like that. But for me, this thing is just too big to be like lugging around all day long. And then it has this little strap right here. So this doesn't fit my lifestyle anymore. This is my new home girl. Like when I say this is my home girl, me and her will never part. I'm already on my second one. It's a half gallon. So I like to fill this up two times and I'm already on my second time. I have to drink this. I'm gonna be done by 7 p.m. Cause if you know me, you know, I just love water. Yeah, I just love water. So that's not really a, um, that's not really a unrealistic task for me because if, if I just had to survive off water, as far as like drinking, cause I, I, I have to eat, but uh, I'm not Jesus, I'm, I'm not him. Yeah, I, I gotta eat. But <laughs> if I had to survive off of one drink alone, I would choose water. But yeah, y'all, like I said, I'm hot. My stomach trying to cramp up on me, so I need to go ahead and like get moving. So I will probably call y'all when I get in the car. I need to get me a mount. Can y'all please let me know like, I need a mount to put like on my dashboard. I've been looking on Amazon, but it's so many choices. If you know of a good name of a mount, please let me know because I would love to have y'all in the car with me. But girl, I haven't been able to find a mount for y'all. Okay, so let me know that. Comment some ideas below for me uh, or some links below for me. And I would greatly appreciate that. And I will call y'all when I get in the car. Okay. Yeah, I absolutely love my truck. Like. Oh my God, I love this car so much. Okay, y'all, so we made it to the car and the lighting isn't the best, but we're going to make the best out of what our current situation. Good job, sis, great job. Keep that mentality, you're gonna go very far in life. Yes, we are. Okay, so look, girl, I just gotta tell y'all because somebody out there needs to hear this. Somebody needs to hear this. Somebody needs to hear this. You are not going to feel like running this business every single day. All that stuff on Instagram is cap. 
C A P cap. And if you don't know the definition of cap, I think I touched out this like a year or so ago, but it's 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 not it's not true. <laughs> it's not true. You're not always going to want to feel like this. Like a real true boss entrepreneur, like that's really having things going on. You're not always going to want to do this. You're not. Today is one of those days where I wanted to just stay in bed and I wanted to eat. Like I just wanted to eat. But I know that that isn't going to get me closer to my end goal. So that's what you got to do. You got to know, okay, is what I'm doing right now going to get me closer to my end goal? If I quit, is that going to get me closer to the end goal? You want a million, you want six figures, you want whatever it is you want. Ask yourself, is what I'm doing right now, my current actions right now, is that going to get me closer to the end goal? If the answer is no, try your best to like mentally get yourself out of that mentality and do what you need to do. My apologies if the camera is shaking, but girl, to tell you the truth, my arm a little tired from holding y'all. Look, child, you know y'all what is heaven now. Y'all need to come to the gym with me. No, I'm just playing, but y'all been going to the gym. I went to the gym today. Uh -oh. I went to the gym today. I'm going to tell you the truth. Didn't feel like doing that. Absolutely didn't feel like doing that, but this is why it's so good to have a good support system. Do y'all know why I went to the um gym today? my boyfriend my boyfriend said baby i'm finna go to the gym i was like oh, okay i don't feel like it he looked at me he didn't even have to say anything he just looked at me because you know i expressed my my goals with my boyfriend and he just looked at me and i, and I already knew what that look meant so i was like you're right baby i'm getting up and i want to go get dressed sometimes he don't feel like it and then i'm his support system and i'm like come on baby let's, let's go knock it out let's go do it we got goals yeah, let's do it. You know, so it's very important to have the right people around you because the right people around you can really kick it up a notch. Like they can turn your life up. Seriously, they can turn your life up. So make sure you got a good circle around you. And if you don't cook, it ain't nothing that cut it. Cut them off. Cut them off. You don't need that energy. Like if you're always the one trying to motivate everybody and nobody ever like pours that same energy back into you, it may be time to, you know, go to a couple brunches, go to a couple of, go out, go meet some people that are like minded. Okay. Because a mind is a terrible thing to waste. And, you know, hopefully if you watch my channel, you ain't wasting your mind. A, a mind is just seriously a terrible thing to waste. But yes, y'all, I was just talking to you while my car warmed up. So I'm about to go ahead and put my pedal to the metal. And I'm about to do the dash to my office so I can get there and get everything done. Of course, I'm going to put my seatbelt on because I'll be seeing a lot of people vlogging without putting their seatbelt on. And girl, arrive alive. Arrive to the destination alive, all right? So yeah, I'm going to call y'all back when I get to my office, okay? Ooh, drink your water and mind your business all 2022. And every year after that, because it's the best thing you can do. Um, But look, y'all, just one more thing I wanted to show you about the new water bottle. I'm not getting paid to say this, by the way, but um, this isn't sponsored. This is just something that I bought with my own money that I genuinely feel is a good purchase for you if you're trying to drink more water. But you know the other one that I showed y'all before? Hold on, grandma, bro. Whew. <laughs> it's okay we're working on it be kind to yourself i said that in my last vlog be kind to yourself girl i am out of shape i'm out of shape and out of breath but we're working on it but yeah so um my last one you just had to twist the no you had to pop the top up yourself and then just you know hold it up this one has a little <laughs> so all you do is press this little button and then your straw is right here and your straw pops out and you just Put it down and then see. I highly suggest this bottle. Okay, let me go put this down. Hold on. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. Um, this is the wig I'm about to work on. It is 26 inches. It's a Mercedes unit. And yeah, my sis wants baby hairs. I have literally made this wig so many times this month. I've made the same wigs, like I said, over and over, but I'm okay with that. That's how I'm perfecting my craft. This is what I want to show y'all. This is a 30 inch wig and it has HD lace and I am so excited. I actually purchased this wig from my glueless wig vendor that I have listed on my website. The thing about me is if I sell something, like I have to really believe in it. Like I have to believe in it. So because I do have this vendor on my website, I have to make sure that the quality stays consistent because I'm not putting my name on something that I don't stand behind. So I got me a 30 inch wig um, to 
where I was gonna say to test out, but honestly, y'all, this vendor has had quality hair for years and it's not changing. But I love this hair. It's so, it's such a good density. Like, I don't like super, super, super thick hair. I don't like thin hair and I don't like it, you know. Hold on, y'all. My office in the city, so hold on. Y'all, if y'all hear cars, it's, it's just cars. <laughs> but yeah, um, you know when you part your hair in the back, it, no tracks are going to be showing. I don't like that, but I don't like that super, super, super thick seven, eight looking bundles. I don't like that. I think I've just outgrown that, honestly, but to each his own, and you can get your wigs customized like that if you would like to, but the lace is what gets me every time. Do y'all see the lace? So this is HD lace, and you see how you, you just can't see it. It's on there, but you can't see it. So this is my glueless wig vendor. They sell bundles as well, y'all. I just say glueless wig because I mainly sell wigs. So that's what I mainly purchase, but this is their bundles. So yeah, this is what it looks like. I cannot wait. This is my wig, by the way. I cannot wait to put this on my head. Super excited about that. And yeah, like one thing I do want to say, like I said, I'm going to be dropping gems like throughout my blogs. What I really want to let y'all know is please do not spend 40 days and 40 nights searching for a vendor. It's not that hard. Like it's either you're going to find you a vendor on your own and test them out or you're going to find somebody you can trust and you feel like you can trust them and you're going to purchase their vendor now i don't believe in the whole vendors list as far as people having 100 200 300 people on their list i just personally feel like there's no way you tested that many vendors and even if you did there's no way all of them are worthy of selling right or recommending they're not worthy of recommending there's not 400 good vendors out there you know um but sis and homeboy do not think about it too much like the vendor is it's not the end all be all like i said find you a vendor yourself like go through the steps of finding your vendor yourself do the work as far as testing out the hair coloring it making sure it's what you want or just buy you a vendor like it's that simple don't self-sabotage we are not doing that this year but yes this is my wig and personally I'm so ready to put this wig on. I'm a dye jet black. And yeah, I'm gonna have a great time with this. But yeah, um, I'm about to go ahead and start working on this wig right here. So let me go put this wig down. Um, matter of fact, I'm about to go ahead and color this wig off camera and then I'm gonna do this one. So I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. Let me bring y'all closer. Okay. Okay, so I colored the wig off camera. It's sitting in the color right now. I'm about to go ahead and start customizing this wig right here. I was actually going to get into a real good conversation, <laughs> but I just thought about it. I have to customize this off camera. You know, I have my plug in and customization tutorial on my website for purchase, so it wouldn't be fair if I show it on YouTube for free. So hopefully you can understand this. Thank you so much. Love y'all so much. I'm about to customize this off camera and then I'll call y'all back when I get ready to flat iron it, okay? Call you back, girl. Okay, y'all, what's up? So I'm back. Um, This is my second wig I already did. The first one is boxed up, packed up, ready for me to take it to UPS. And um, yeah, I'm at the top of this wig right now. I'm almost done silk pressing it out. Um, This doesn't take me long to do it all. I can flat iron a unit in like 25 minutes. So this didn't really take me anytime i have to do baby hair on this unit my other unit i just did baby hair too so it's been a minute since i did baby hair honestly like my sis really do not order baby hair like that and i love it if you want baby hair i'm gonna flick it out for you i got you but i love a clean look like i love no baby hair wigs they are just so nice to me they're so sleek they're so realistic looking they're just i just love it but to each his own girl look that's let's talk about this matter of fact it just be rolling off my tongue let's talk about this so you heard what i just said i like right if you like baby hair do not let what i just said deter you or stop you from wearing your baby hair don't do that. I've noticed a lot of times people will hear their favorite influencer or they'll hear somebody who they feel like, you know, they'll just hear somebody say something and they'll think, oh, you know what? Yeah, I need to stop doing that. Like, 
For example, I was watching this perfume haul collection because if you didn't know, baby, I love perfume. So I was watching this guy rate perfume or whatever. And he was talking about some of the perfumes and he was just saying trash, trash, trash. Like just saying a lot of the perfumes stinks. And you know, me, I'm like, boy, first of all, if you didn't know, perfumes smell different on you know, everybody. So what smells good on me might not smell good on you and vice versa. It can smell so good on you and it can make me smell just hideous, atrocious. It can just make me stink. Okay? We need to know that body chemistry. Anyway, let me get back on track. So he was really just dogging a lot of the perfumes and by me reading the comments, because I know I'm not the only person that does this when I'm watching a video, I read the comments. By me reading the comments, I was really seeing people saying, oh no, now I gotta throw away my such and such. I gotta throw away my... Look, if somebody... Now, it's different. If somebody is giving you like life-changing advice and you know like 100% it's a fact that this is going to make your life better, okay, you, you can listen to that person. But at the end of the day, what perfumes that man like, that is his opinion. And just because he said it stinks, that don't mean you have to throw it out. So, what I'm trying to say, I gave that example to say, just because somebody doesn't like what you like, that doesn't mean what you're doing is wrong. Like, do not let people change your whole perspective on things in life. What works for you may not work for them, and what works for them may not work for you. I get this example all the time. Two plus two is four, but so is three plus one. Like literally, there are different ways to get to the same outcome. So you can still look popping if you like baby hair on your wig. And I can still look popping without liking baby hair on my wigs, y'all. Like, you know, comparing yourself and just trying to bring yourself to society standards. Like, who is he to tell you that? you need to throw this perfume away. I know it's just his opinion, but you know, like, let it just be that people's opinion. Do what works for you. At the end of the day, you cannot take these people's opinions to the rent office and you can't pay your mortgage with it either, okay? So do what works for you. We are here for a good time, not a long time, okay? And as far as I know, we got one life, so Live it how you see fit. And do not let people change. Like I said, unless they're giving you some real good quality, like, okay, I know what he or she's saying. This this going to make my life way better so I can listen to this piece of advice. You can do that. But anybody else, girl, please, live your life. Live your life, Miss Mamas. And live your life home, boy, okay? Cause one thing about me, one thing about me <laughs> i'm gonna live mine <laughs> i'm gonna live mine i don't care what y'all like if i like it i am at the top of the hair just still pressing it out let me show y'all well i'll show y'all later when i finish i need to finish this it's not hard to see the quality mm -hmm. i love it here i really do i love it here I sleep so well at night knowing I sell a quality product. Like, I don't know how people be sleeping when they know like they doing people wrong or they know they out here selling trash. I really don't know. Me, I could never sleep. I'd be like, oh my God, is God gonna come get me in my dreams for selling all this bad hair? <laughs> I couldn't do it. I couldn't. But to each his own, girls, to each his own. Oh, y'all see that? Mm. But yeah, y'all, so I was gonna say, so what's up? But like y'all can hear me and actually respond to me right now, but I can read the comments. What's up, girl? What y'all working on? Like what I'm really finna take serious, like I had to talk to myself today, y'all, for real. Like I had to let my know, my know what? <laughs> I had to let myself know, like you're tripping, you're making excuses, you're procrastinating. And the only person you're hurting is yourself. And what I'm speaking about mainly is my weight loss. One thing about me, I can do anything I put my mind to. I can really do anything I want to. Like, if I wanted to be a personal trainer, I could. 
I don't want to, but I'm just saying I could. Anything I want to do, I can do. That being said, I can lose weight. I'm just playing around. I'm playing around. Like yesterday, me and my boyfriend went out to eat. Girl, I did not need two appetizers. Why did I do that? You know, just all had to die hard. But like I said, be kind to yourself. But it's, I'm glad I just said that. It's a difference between being kind to yourself and enabling yourself. At this point, I'm enabling myself. I know I want to lose weight. I know I want to get back to the weight that I feel my best at mentally and physically because personally, I'm not going to speak for anybody else, but personally, I feel a big difference when I'm at a healthier weight. So I want to, I want to operate, you know, as my highest self. And right now I'm high, but I am my highest, you know? <laughs> The confidence is going to be there regardless, whether I was what I want to be or whether I was bigger than I am. So <laughs> you can forget that. We're not lacking self-confidence on this channel. That's not what we do. Yeah, I know it's a few house rules. <laughs> not really. I just make them as I go. But yeah, girl, what we do have is self-confidence. And we're always going to be that girl or that boy, no matter what. But getting back on track. Oh, girl, y'all really just let me sit here and ramble all day long and swear y'all like the videos. But if y'all like it, I love it because, baby, talking to myself, it's my specialty. <laughs> but not for real, y'all. Um, I just really need y'all to understand. Like, sometimes you're the problem. Sometimes you're the problem. Sometimes it's not your customers. Sometimes it's not your family members, your friends. Sometimes it's you, you know? And in this instance, I am the problem. And because I know that I'm the problem, I'm about to genuinely make a change to fix it. I've been going to the gym, but you know, I told y'all earlier in the vlog, I didn't feel like going to the gym. The only reason I really went is because my boyfriend motivated me to go. I don't need him to motivate me. I need to motivate myself. I'm thankful to God to have him to be there for me to motivate me, but I need to have that. I need to motivate myself. So, as far as weight loss, I'm really finna give it a go. So, I'm starting in two days. So, by the time you see this video, feel free to start. But, I'm starting in two days. I'm finna really kick it up a notch. I'm finna kick it up a notch. Like, I am about to kick it up. You heard it here first. Let me look at y'all. You heard it here first. I am about to really just stay on top of myself at the end of the day. I'm blessed to be able to eat healthy food. Okay, because some people don't have food at all. But y'all, I'm about to get it together. I have been wearing my trainer and I am losing weight, you know, so I'm not being too hard on myself. I'm just being honest with myself. And honestly speaking, I'm not doing everything I could be doing to see the results that I need to see. Okay, but yeah, y'all, so this is um, what the unit looks like after I straighten it. I am about to fleek the top and do the baby hairs. I'll come back and show y'all the final results. And yeah, girl, I'll call you a minute. All right, y'all, so I am finished. This is what the back of the hair is looking like after I've still pressed it out. It is so pretty, so, so pretty. And then this is the front of the wig. Like I said, my sis went in baby hair and I did her some swoops. Let me see, can y'all see it? Yes, you can, but yes, I love it. Yes, so clean, so sleek. I love it. So I'm about to go ahead and pack sis up. Somebody did ask me a question in my last video, um, whether or not I just put the wig in a box and no, I use satin bags. My vendor makes satin bags as well. So I do put this inside of the satin bag, then inside of the box. Um, hold on. So I showed y'all my box in the last vlog and y'all, I will forever be proud of this box like if you know where i started with my boxes or with my packaging period like with my packaging i started with those little bubble mailers like 
literally just the plain bubble mailers and just look at me now you know this is why you keep going this is why you keep hustling y'all this this is what you do it for but anyways um i showed y'all this in my last video um these are the boxes i gotta put this down hold on okay so i meant to say these are the bags so these are my satin bags it just has my logo on it but i mainly just want y'all to look at the color of it if you do purchase my packaging vendor they do have all colors so whatever color you want it doesn't have to be pink it's just my brand color is pink so whatever color you want they have and yeah i just wanted to answer that question because like i said somebody asked me in my last video about um what else do i use to pack up my stuff all right y'all so that is the end of the video if you have made it this far thank you so much for watching oh my god y'all i just feel so happy to be back we are two for two like two videos back to back who am i a youtuber because like i said i'm really taking this serious this go around okay all right yeah so thank you again for watching um don't forget to follow me on instagram at okay so that's her and if you have a tiktok okay so that's mercedes if all you have is youtube that is perfectly fine sis it's okay don't sweat it i need to go ahead and pack this wig up run a ups and i gotta go to Publix and some other little running around to do so yeah i'll call y'all later thank you so much for watching and i'll talk to y'all in my next video bye